everyone and welcome back to my channel it's your girl simply wive and today i bring you another part of the 100 day challenge so i was just like re-watching some of the last parts of the 100 day challenge and i know we kind of fell off a little bit but i really wanted amor to enjoy herself but i think they have a few more hours left of their vacation so we will be slowly getting back into the challenge in the next couple of parts but if you guys didn't get a chance please go check out the last part because some crazy things went down at the end of it but now we have the girls out here roasting some marshmallows about to tell some scary stories and yeah so let's go ahead and get into it i'm like ready to get back home to the baby where is jenna going I have no idea. But Amor is supposed to be telling the story after she roasts her marshmallow. Oh, and she hit, ate it. It was too hot. Everybody's leaving. Oh, okay. How many marshmallows are we going to roast? Like, mm -hmm. Alexis over here passing gas. I don't know what she ate. All right. Amor is about to tell a ghost story. Alex is the only one here for it. I really, how do we see how much long, like how much longer we have? What's lifestyle coaching? Okay. How do we see how much longer we have on vacation? Let me see if I hit extend vacation. Okay, we have a less than one day. Hey, yeah, I think the girls, like in the morning, I'm gonna have them all go to, to bed really quick. But like in the morning, morning, we're gonna get ready to go. So I will see y'all in the morning. Oh my gosh, y'all, we have like two hours left on vacation. Do we have anything in the fridge that we can eat really quick? So girls are gonna miss this, but it's time to get back to reality. It's time for everybody to get back to work. It's time for people to get back with their significant others and their kids. So yeah. Laura is about to eat something. And I think after that, we'll only have like an hour left. I do want her to take a quick shower before she goes. Oh my gosh, look. Amor is homesick. So maybe she is ready to get back to the baby. Oh no, she's eating the spoiled food. Amor, no. Let's send Omar a quick text message letting him know. Oh, and that's it. That's it, we're going home. All right, I'll see you later. Oh my gosh, her property taxes are due. Y'all, let's pay these bills. That's goodness, okay. So let's pay the property taxes, and let's pay the utility bills. Let's pay everything. And then we also need to make a loan payment. Oh, we must have something in the bank. Oh, we had something in the bank. Um, you're gonna go to your baby first. I know she's asleep. Let's go cuddle her. Let's go cuddle baby girl. Let's go cuddle her. And then you can use the bathroom. Yeah, let me just see what's going on with her. Make sure she ain't. Oh. Uh, Oh, okay, it's difficult to interact with a child toward whom feelings are so complicated and negative. I wonder if there's a way, because I'm going to make her accept this child. It's time. We can go ahead and send Omar home. So let's come give him a hug. First, let's ask him for some money, okay? I know you just paid for this trip, sir, but can we get some money? You can ask him for any money. Okay, 0% chance of becoming pregnant. Thank you. All right. Let's just 
give him a hug and thank him for taking care of the baby while we were trying to get it together. And then we're going to go ahead and send him home. We'll have her take a quick shower while he goes home. So it is official. It is Amora's first day home alone with the baby. Tiana is calling her. Hey Amora, I think Daichi Harada is pretty cute. Should I ask him out? Yes, romance is in the air. Why not? But yes, this is officially Amora's first day home alone with the baby. And if you guys see, her household funds went up a lot. It's Omar left an envelope full of cash on her bed and dipped it out of here. So I don't know what that is supposed to mean, but she's going to do what she needs to do with this money. And we're going to go pay off a big chunk of our loan. But first, I want to take out what she has in the bank. So we can go ahead and pay most of this off. And I also want to see if we can apply for any type of like child support or government assistance since she is not allowed to have a job so hopefully that is something that we can do so that way that will generate some steady income for her because she's going to need it so let me see i think i have to use the mailbox so we're going to government's what's the child support Gives a non-custodial parent option to opt out if they meet all of the below criteria. Household wealth cannot be more than 550. Residential lots. Oh, that's to stop it. Child support. Okay, let me see. Please select the sim you wish to set child support direct deposit to. The beneficiary is the baby, so it's only 100%. But can we apply for it? Does that mean that we applied for it? Oh, it says the residential lot value cannot be more than 400 simoleons. Does not receive, or rent cannot be. Okay, so we can't do that. But hopefully. He'll still continue to pay, but I think I'm going to go ahead and have her go to the bank so we can go ahead and pay off most of this loan, if not all of it, and we'll hire a nanny, a nanny for the baby. Okay, so the baby has been sent to daycare. We're going to take off this face mask. Okay, she's done. Hopefully, we have actual tellers so that way we can pay off this loan. I think we do have some here because there's so many people some of these people have to be tellers like there's no way it's just a teller perfect okay so we're going to come up to the bank teller we just got the capital one we're going to come up to the bank teller and we're going to request assistance it's like a lot of people showed up on their days off because i'm pretty sure they don't need is this the guy she said he was cute. Okay, you know what? Not Amora's behind the counter. I can't. But we're about to pay off. Let's see how much they're asking for. So we're going to make a loan payment. I'm sorry, but it doesn't like you have a loan agreement with us. We have loan offices available to take any credit request you might have. So feel free to go meet with them. Girl, okay. All right, how much do we have that they're saying that we owe? Let me see. I guess because we got it through their partner, but let's just say we came here to pay a bunch of it down. We should almost be done paying it off though. I feel like, but I think we have more than enough to pay it off. I mean. We have 18 payments left. Okay. I just want to be done with it. So we can really see how much money we have. Nine. Oh my gosh, we're almost done.
four more and we still have a good chunk of money left i think it's our last one one more that's it and we're done now we can destroy it What did it say? Debt paid. Congratulations. Amora has paid off the Sim City Bank loan now that she is debt free. She can destroy the loan packet in her inventory. Perfect. Now, we're going to head on back home to spend some more time with the baby. Oh, Lord, this girl. It's like she is prone to getting crab lice now. Luckily, we have a couple bottles of the shampoo. So I'm going to have her. I'm gonna take a quick shower really quick and then she's gonna use the shampoo because I can't I can't at this point it's like it is her now we're gonna have her apply some lotion I don't know why you keep wanting to talk to this man let's come check on the baby let's feed her And then let's also rock her and make a silly face. I know it's hard for her to get used to the baby, but this is the only way she's going to be able to do it is if she's actually around and actually present and doing things for the baby. Oh, that's so cute. Still haven't decided what to do with this room yet but maybe we can find something to do that will earn a more some money because she's gonna need that maybe we could turn this into like a workout room for now since the more is not like she has to be here primarily with the baby so we could turn it into like a little workout room for her to work off some of the baby weight still be able to be right here so i think i'm gonna get her a treadmill just something simple nothing too much nothing too much to get her little treadmill and we're gonna have her come and work out I'm gonna have to define her pregnancy wish because um uh, how is she feeling right now does not want a pregnancy right now how do we oh we're gonna have her attempt to bond with the baby i didn't know that was an option let's have her attempt to bond with the baby and see how that goes Oh my gosh, please, please. You had your girls trip. This is your baby. Hopefully you feel a little bit better. Let's attempt to bond with the baby. He's trying. It took a bit of time, but Amora is now at peace with her child. She would do her best to be a good parent to baby. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about, Amora. She is good to go. So she's gonna go ahead and get a little workout in. And guys, I think this is where I'm gonna leave this part. So Amora came back from vacation. She still was like warming up to the baby, but she finally has bonded with the baby. I'm so excited. We got her little treadmill. She paid off her loan. Like she's doing big things. I'm so happy for her. I'm so happy that she worked through her feelings about the baby. And now we can move forward. Thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share my videos. Also, turn on your post notifications so you never miss out when I post. Thank you all so much again, and I'll see you in the next video.